in this presentation, if I just go to this second slide, um, I'm not really happy with this second slide. I'm not sure how you feel, but it's, um, it doesn't really conform to my theme. I've got this word over here that somebody seems to have highlighted and changed the color. I've got these icons which don't really fit into the theme itself and if I change the theme the icons stay the same. So does this colored word and it's because that somebody has highlighted it and selected a specific color, not even a theme color. They've gone through and selected a specific color. Then we've got these bullets which somebody has put in manually so they've highlighted it and changed the bullets problem is they don't fit with theme and I want to be able to change my theme quite quickly and something that you you probably don't notice because uh, we've not seen a lot of slides in this presentation with text is that the font is larger on these slides which means that if I'm going through a presentation I've added some more text in this page will stand out because the text is all of a sudden a bit bigger. So we want continuity and have everything look the same and take all the attributes from the um, from the masters. Okay, so what we do is we go to the home tab and the first thing I need to do to check that this is going to work is I've got a two column here with a heading and I need to check layout to make sure, yeah, it is two content with a heading. If it was a title, that means that these two text boxes were um, added in manually via maybe the insert and text box and somebody's put them in and that means that they're not taking their formatting from the, the master. Somebody's gone through, added them, and then put in the formatting. But if we're using a layout where we use the boxes or the placeholders, okay, and in this case we are, we have the two with the heading, then we can reset it back to the theme or what the master says it should be. And that's preferable because then we're spending less time formatting and we have uh, continuity throughout our whole presentation so it looks more professional. So now that we know that the layout does conform to the theme, I'm now going to tell it to reset it and get rid of this extra formatting. And we do that through this little button here. So I click on it and it's simple as that. It's gotten rid of those bullets, it's gotten rid of that color, and that was it. Just a reset. And you can go through a presentation and select and reset. And depending on the presentation it might do absolutely nothing. Because maybe somebody didn't change any of the formatting, they just let the formatting come from the um, the theme. And if so, great. But if you've received a presentation where somebody's applied all the formatting manually, and you might have different size fonts on every slide, then you can reset the theme quite quickly to get a, a harmonious, professional looking presentation. So all it is is check the um, layout matches, all the placeholders match, then you can click on this and it will reset it. Otherwise if you just click on this throughout the whole uh, presentation you'll find that some slides change, some slides don't. So that's resetting a slide.